All right, back in the uh, sec the second part, or whatever part you'd call this, the Graveyard of the Giants, um, I may have figured out something about this room. I'm not sure what yet, but um, I started interacting with things. I'm going to do this on camera so we can kind of see things in real time. So um, stepping on these seems to... Yeah, you see that? The clamp kind of like spat some fire and made the ice chunk up there disappear. Um, and down I fall, because I'm good at games. Just go back up. Okay. So yeah, so I can make that disappear. Probably want to get rid of these ice puffs, because they will make my life hell. Repeatedly knock me down to the next screen, or knock me down to the spikes, where I can't fight back against bullying. Okay. And then I think I can just let this thing lower far enough for me to drop a weight on this. Yep. And that did that one. That seems needlessly stacked, but... And I felt something kind of rumble in the gamepad here and open off to the side, so I'm going to go take a look. Also, I think it's worth saying, other people have noticed it, but um, take a look. I'm, I'm playing this game with the Xbox 360 controller for Windows. Um, other people have noticed this, I think it's worth calling out. Um, I really, really like it. Uh, this game comes with native Xbox 360 controller support. And I don't own an actual Xbox, but I have one of the controllers for a PC gamepad because there's so many games that have really good native support for it, and this is one of them. I mean, not only are the buttons good and the controls are tight and the analog sticks, shockingly, work really, really well, but um, Rumble. This game actually natively supports Rumble. So, like, when that puzzle opened a second ago, I actually felt the controller shake a bit. So, anyway. Um... I think I may have, like, dropped that block up there. I don't remember seeing that before. Let's keep looking. Yeah, that seems to be the only new thing, really. Oh, oh no, this is here. I'm almost dead, but who cares? What did that do? <laughs> I'll come back and find out. Okay, level's now... Well, this screen is now mostly cleared of hazards. Let's see what this does. I'm trying to get spiked to death. I felt yet another thing open. That was probably back upstairs. Let's take the ladder here and find out. Ah, yeah, that wall disappeared. Oh, good, good. Okay, let's go up there. I, I don't know why this has to be so redundantly sequenced. I mean, can't you just make me have me open one pedestal that does something? Rather than have a pedestal that opens another pedestal that has an open another pedestal? It just seems like needless busy work. Anyway, I'm assuming that did something somewhere. Maybe that killed another wall down towards the bottom left. I think that was the only one that's left, so let's go see. Yee! Amaze it, you need to get cleats so you can deal better with this ice. And yep, that one goes away. Okay, predictable. And I'll see what that one does. Ooh, that creates a ladder, which goes right back up to where I was before. That's the most exciting thing in the entire universe. I want to shoot this Ice Mage in the face. Sadly, I probably even that won't one-shot it. We'll see. Whoa, what the hell? Was I just sitting in the floor there? Huh, I think I might have been glitched briefly. That was weird. Anyway, let's get back up. Enough dicking around. Damn it! Okay, I go straight up the middle. Oh, and then I can get up here. Let's go in this door first. I'm getting claustrophobic here. When we were... Oh my god, a giant is still alive, kind of in a necromorph form, but... When we were building the tower, we decorated it with statues of goddesses, although someone made copper statue in a different shape. If I remember correctly, that person was good at using weapons, and it said they hit a treasure here that could power up weapons. Really, is it just me, or is it really cramped in here? Yeah, it's cramped, you're a freaking giant, dude. Alright, let's read this. Take your new weapon in hand, and take down the, the wall that blocks thy way. Probably the axe. Kill this thing first. And then move this thing. Do the thing with the thing. Ah! Get another ladder. Okay, this is a weapons chest. Uh, what do you oh yeah, there's a mid-boss here. Oh, fuck shits, I'm not prepared for this. My health is too low. Alright, pistol time, I think. I don't see any other way of winning this. Okay, he's like a yeti with long claw arms. Come here, dude. Six rounds, enough to kill anything it moves. Now you'll see why they call me La Mesa. I 
had to reload, but that's fine. We've got five rounds left. According to some resource, I don't know if it's accurate, this thing does 15 damage per hit. I don't really know how much that is, but apparently it's a lot. Yeah, that was close. Attempt number two. I'm just going to shoot this dude in the face. I really see no reason to do anything otherwise. As soon as I can get a good vantage point on him. Ouch. Make sure I don't hit the chest instead. Yeah, this would probably take repeated attempts if I had something other than the gun. Wow, it's taken four rounds. Ouch. Oh, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> when you use the most broken weapon in the game. What's this? Grenades? A, a bomb. Ay, yikes. Okay. Does that mean now I can like use that to blow open walls? No, oh, well, that Zelpin will tell me. It's me, it's an explosion. Have you gotten a hold of a bomb? If you throw the bomb, it'll fly in a slight upwards kind of arc, so you'll be in trouble if you throw it in a tight spot. You can also roll it in the ground by throwing it while holding it down. Okay, let us try it on a wall that we think might be destructible. In fact, there might be many walls that are destructible. Also, sadly, I can't dismount ladders, but I can use a weapon while I'm on the ladder, so wise people have told me. <laughs> yes. All right, let's get back up here and see what we got. I think that'll actually link me back to the rest of the graveyard that I was able to access before. Dead. Silence. Because there's nothing for UD to talk about. Oh, fuck, down I go. I feel like my investments have just returned a negative... Ugh. Anyway. Oh, yeah. Somebody asked me a favor. Um... So apparently, in the last video, I wasn't really thinking about it, but in the last video I said that I dislike pie f flavors. I, I, I'm sorry, I retract that. It was just a random bit of idiocy. I didn't really mean it. There, there's some pie flavors that I like, there's some that I don't like. Probably my favorite pie is a cheesecake. I mean, I know it's called a cake, even though... I mean, it's called a cake, but really it's more of a pie, because there's no, like, you know, ex expansion to it. It's just basically a pie, so that'd be my favorite. Yeah, I, you notice I've gotten that map on prior attempts and then died and then never saved getting it again. So you get to see me get the map twice. What lovely fun. All right, so now I'm back in the rest of the graveyard. I don't really think I can access any more of it than I could before. I'll confirm that with a guide, and then it may be time to go tackle Confusion Gate. You know, at this point, the, the expectation riding around on the lower level of my brain is that as bad as Confusion Gate is, that there's nothing that it can it can do to me that really exceeds the bullshit that's been handed to me up at this point. And yet yeah, I know that it's Confusion Gate. And if there's one thing that Naramura was clever at, it was making something stupidly fucking impenetrable. So, I've put it off long enough. Let's get this shit over with. God, I don't want to do this. Uh, may as well get started. Madness awaits. Ooh, you're tough. Not tougher than me. But the dozens of you I'm going to have to kill are probably tougher than me. Whoa. Ghosty woman. Dingo's jumping around. Simply wandering will not lessen the illusion. Courage will grant thy wish. The courage to jump into the illusion. The courage to search on bended knee for a single fallen item. Okay, so that's something you have to scan all over the place. I'll be doing that for sure. So far, so straightforward. Nothing's really killed me yet. It's spooky, certainly. Nothing there. I'll have to decide which of the versions of the Confusion Gate theme song I like better. Although... Oh, this is the room! This is it! This is the room where the invisible fucking ladder was! Oh god. But they told me that's been removed from this version. One fool believed in his foolishness that he was a wise man. The fool flaunted his shallow wisdom and made decisions with a narrow mind. He protected... 
to the right. He protected to the right without hesitation, or proceeded to the right without hesitation. Another fool possessed wisdom, but his, in his but his knowledge led him to believe he was a fool. The fool who smothers himself without first consider a fool who smothers himself without first considering the situation. He went with the flow and proceeded to the left. One can only hope that a true wise man stands here now. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna press up anyway, because you know what? Fuck it. There's not gonna hurt anything. So. Why do I get the feeling that going left and right are still both wrong? Oh god, I don't... Let's read this again, okay. One fool believed in his foolishness, he's a wise man. The fool fell into shallow wisdom and made decisions within her mind. He proceeded to the right without hesitation. Another fool possessed wisdom, but his knowledge led him to believe he was a fool. A fool who smothers himself without first considering the situation. Fuck it. Let's just do it. Where does this leave me? Fighting demonic jumping dingoes, it looks like. Hmm. I can't immediately tell which what this did to me. If anything, really. Oh. Huh. I don't know how I'm supposed to get that chest open, but I randomly ran into it, lol. Anyway, moving on. Nothing there. Get the axe out. Those things are heavy duty. Good. I can still dis-shield them. It's like diverginalizing, except you're taking away a shield. Ah. An exit. What do you want to bet this isn't actually an exit? This is not only going to end the game and delete my save file and format my hard drive, but it's also going to stick like an arm out of my computer screen IRL and stab me in the chest. <sighs> Graveyard of the Giants. Oh, fuck, yeah. I can't get back in. I have to start over. What lovely joy. Let's not even go up this ladder room for just a minute. Let's look over here first. Have I been here? I'm not sure if I have. Yeah, I've been over here. So this is a, those are one ways. That only brings me back in. I can't go out. So, alright, let's go up. But, yeah, that gets me to the same room. We're not into that great of level of mindfuckery just yet. There. Once again, we'll go left just to keep consistency so I don't get confused with my own failed attempts at manipulating my own life. Not going up there just yet. Can't go here just yet. Yeah, whatever. Go ahead and bounce between the levels. I don't even care. Hmm. So, could I have come to a dead end already? Maybe I do have to go right, we'll see. It's going back this way. So where's this mindfuckery? I, I remember Confusion Gate being really, really hostile. I mean, because, believe it or not, I actually did a good chunk of Confusion Gate when I played this uh, on my own without LP. Because if memory serves, you had to go through Confusion Gate to get to V. So, anyway, let's go this way now. This part I haven't been to yet, I don't think. Yeah, I haven't. Fall down there if I can help it. Uh, looks like I can't help it going down. Uh, let's see, across, yeah, that thing, okay. Nothing here, okay, going up. Except, oh no, I can go down here and explore this portion that I can't really do anything down there because of spikes. You know what, I'll come back later. Not worried about it, let's move on. Okay, so, yeah, I've been here before. Well, I guess. Oh yeah, some, something about courage about jumping into your own death. Let's do that. No, nothing? Nothing down here? Hmm. Oh yeah, that's destructible. I have to... <sighs> I'm gonna kill myself before I can get there. Yeah, fuck. A wise man once told me, Hey, UD, you can use your weapons while you're on ladders. Except that's not doing anything. Huh. How am I supposed to attack this thing, then? A bomb, maybe? Later on, somebody may set us up the bomb. Yeah, I need to be able to find a way to get my weapons down there without killing myself. Um, let's take a look at my subs. Let's try a bomb, see what this gets me. Other than killed. Ah, gets me killed, okay. Yep, alright. Let's try rolling it. There we go, okay. And then do some ninja in there. And this just gets me a bunch of money, who gives a shit, goddammit. Alright, um... What else? Alright, I'll come back. I just scanned right here in this room, 
and a chime played. I don't know what it was I scanned or what it was I did. Yeah, I'm going to come back and see if I can get it on camera. Okay, I, I did something, but I clicked out of it so fast I didn't really see what I was doing. So I've loaded for my last save, and I'm going to see if I can get this on camera. The, there's a blue glowing light in the background here. All right, it seems there's some sort of writing written here, but it's impossible to decipher. That's what popped up. And that just caused the chime to sound somewhere. Um, so I, I don't know what it did. I'll, I'll come back when I find out. There's another blue glowing light here. Let's see if I can scan it. No. Okay, so it wasn't the light. There was just something on the floor that I was supposed to be looking at, I think. I just fell through a hole in the floor. I'll, I'll come back and see if I can show it to you again. Okay, I think I was just about here. Um, yeah, I forget exactly where it was, but I... I it totally fell through a hole in the floor. Right here, right here, right here. And come down and just fell... That makes no sense whatsoever. I fell through the floor and then came down from the ceiling in the same room. Thy understanding is impressive, wise one. Be thee a wise man or a fool, thine actions will reveal the truth, in hopes that thou art, thou art a true wise man. Uh, that wasn't wisdom, that was dumb luck. There's no reason I could have figured that out. <sighs> okay, um... Whoa. Ah, oh, the teleporters, yeah. Okay, let's... <laughs> See where I can get with this. In fact, let's let's get a knife out so I can kill these pots more quickly. I'm probably gonna have to brute force those teleporters. Yep. In fact, let's let's go back and see where it takes me. Oh, nowhere. Okay. Right back here. Huh? All right. Um, I'm gonna need to figure out these teleporters. Well, my problem is, is if I if I do it off camera, then as soon as I figure out the solution, I'll be off camera and I won't be able to show you unless I come back and duplicate it. Let's, let's just try it once more on camera here, see what we get. Glad I got a lot of weights, and indeed unlimited money necessary to get them. Okay, so I come down here. Go up the ladder. Okay, go over here. Don't go into that just yet, let's go up here first. Okay, fuck this. You guys get the axe. Can I go in this? I can't go in this. Alright, let's just go upstairs. Put a wait here. Don't know what that did. Don't see anything on this screen, so I'll just move on. Oh, oh, a ladder. Awesome. I wonder if that's a shortcut that'll let me get up here more easily now. Hope so. Die! Anywho, uh, moving on, moving on. Now, I wonder if I'm actually supposed to use these teleporters to get anywhere. Let's try it. Don't go back. Go. F well, let's go down, actually. The fool never find his way. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty foolish compared to this game. This game is way smarter than I am. The ghost! What was I supposed to do? Did I interact with it somehow? Uh, oh, I haven't been here before. Let's go down. That's a different teleportation effect. I wonder if it just means I'm starting over again. I haven't gone over here. Oh, I haven't been here yet. Yes, I have. Let's see if I can go back this way. Yep. Oh. Oh. Ooh, close. <laughs> oh, I have no idea about anything ever. It looks like I started over. Lovely. Uh, I think I've got to interact with that ghost somehow, I'm betting, but I don't... I don't know how. Let me brute force a bit more. Okay, I think I may have this teleporter maze down. I just need to see if I can randomly find my way up to the solution. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. There we are. Okay. So, um, I'll admit this is based in part on a hint that somebody gave me. Um, he said that uh, in the room with the pots, the final teleport is neither on the far left nor the far right. And I thought, well, let's use some invisible ladder logic then and start trying to go up and down. And so I started scanning and I started going up and down until I came here. I think that's the final teleport. Let's see. Um, except that dumps me back to where I was before. <laughs> let's let's see if I can get back there. Okay. Okay, 
Okay, so go down. Yep. And go into that teleporter. The ghost is doing something that I can't really interact with. Oh, wait a second. I have to follow the ghost, don't I? I may have lost her. Yeah, let's see if I can get to follow her again. It might even be a timing thing. Okay, so no ghost here. Nor is there a ghost here. Was it just coincidence? Hmm. The thing is, that... That only got me back to where I was before, though. It wasn't really anything new. Yeah, I'm already... Oh, here we go. Okay, so I can... In other words, the teleporter doesn't catch me, and then I can go through the wall. Okay, fair enough. Well, not fair enough. This is horrible, but... Still pretty par for the course for Lama Lana bullcrap. Um, what do you want to bet this water is poisonous to me, even with the scale sphere? That's why there's a platform here. I don't, I don't want to step in it. I really just don't want to find out. I'd rather just be cautious. What does this person have to say? A favor to ask of the one who disturbs my slumber. There's something I want you to do for me if you don't want to get out of my face. I'll do it for you. So anyway, the fairies hid, hid the treasure I had fraudulently collected. What? What's wrong with fraud? I heart fraud. It seems like the fairies made some sort of giant face swallow up the treasures, and what better to make f uh, make one spit things up than a pepper? Is that it? How about it? you bring back and I'll pay you... F bring the treasure back to me and I'll pay you 500 gold. Achoo. Yikes, if I got I got pepper up my nose. If I can't get my beloved treasures back, I can't rest peacefully and it's killing me. So go on and look for it. Don't come back until you find it. All right. Um, this one I might remember something about. Um, so a giant face. There was a whole bunch of giant face facades back in Gai Gaiden's Gate. And why not look there? Because, come on, it's the it's the opposite side of this level. So let's go. Go back to Gaiden's Gate. Let's see. Let's see if we can find a giant face facade to throw this pepper into. And as a matter of fact, yeah, it is a usable item, so we'll get that up to usable. And um, as a matter of fact, I think it may have even been like the first major face uh, right before the entrance based on memory, so we'll go look at that. There's actually several in Guidance Gate, but we may as well just like start with the frontmost one and then work our way back so we have a good sequential thing to operate on. <laughs> Alright, what did this give me? Treasures! Awesome. Now, I didn't find a Grail Stone uh, or a Grail Point in Confusion Gate, so I gotta go back there the long way. Okay, returning this dude's treasures. Ah, my beloved treasures. Gross, it's covered in slimy spit. How dare you get my treasures all sticky? You don't deserve anything more than this piece of junk. An anchor. <laughs> oh, get out of my face. Okay. I think it said... Yeah, I, I didn't have it on camera, but I think it said, based on the item description, that the uh, treasures were s drooled upon because they were in the mouth of that statue? Because rocks have bodily fluids, right? Anyway, I'm betting the anchor means I can probably move down this very, yep, very fast-flowing water, and it doesn't even kill me. Shocker. <laughs> right. Let's kill this asshole. Again. Okay. I'm tempted to think I should be able to do something before going down this ladder, but... Oh, well. I guess not. Read this. The fool who relies only on what his eyes do see... Sh so I shall wander this labyrinth for eternity. Um, dude, I haven't been relying on what my eyes can see. I've been brute forcing bullshit. Um, anyway, so there's this. I notice there's this person-shaped block here, and then there's the same pattern kind of on the upper right. Um, not sure how to interact with that. But again, the fool who relies only on what his eyes do see. <laughs> oh, <laughs> walked right through the wall. Herp derp. What did this do for me? Made that go away. Alright, let's talk to whoever's in here. Want to become small? Thou art oh, small already. I shall bestow upon thee this mini doll. With this power, prove that thou art indeed small. Okay. What do I bet this is going to shrink me? And indeed, what, what should I even do with that? Eh, not there. Okay. Let's move on. Might be some part of Confusion Gate that I can only fit through if I'm tiny. Randomly going through the 
teleporters here in hopes of getting back. In fact, let's just go... Can I forcibly go downstairs and see if this will let me get back to anything I've already been to? Not this. Not this. Here we are. This is the failure portal as I understand it. Okay, let's go down. Uh-huh. need to get small somewhere. Yeah. It's probably an indication of where I'm supposed to get small, honestly. Not here, I wouldn't think. I'll find it. I'll, I'll find it and come back. I remembered that usable items can be brought to Zelpit for inspection, so let's do that for the pepper real quick. Oh, at perfect timing. I was eating a eating a bat salad? That sounds nasty. And I want to add a bit extra punch of the flavor. Give me that pepper. Ah, it really brings out the bitter bat taste. Okay, whatever. Yeah, so that's all I get to say. This demo's... <laughs> Alright, so that's all I get to say about the pepper. Let's try then the doll. What's up with that dirty doll? You used to prove you're a little man? That don't make a lick of sense. Why don't you try using that place that makes you look like a little man? That would be the Mausoleum of the Giants, wouldn't it? I'll be back. Okay, I didn't capture it on camera, but I used this thing in the Mausoleum of the Giants here, and I heard a chime. Um, nothing's changed about me. I don't look or feel any different than I did before. I'll go back to Confusion Gate and see if anything's changed there. I don't know what did it, but I was just wandering around up in this upper level randomly, trying to find where it is I'm supposed to use the doll now that I'm supposedly quote-unquote shrunken. And that chest down there that, that was in the uh, wall that I revealed opened up. I, I, don't, I, I don't know what I did. Really. I'll get back to it. Okay, I'm back here. Let's hope it's still open when I remove the wall. Yep. Oh, the map. Awesome. That really doesn't tell me a whole lot. Um, okay, just wandering around at random trying to figure out where to, what to do and where to go. I'm right below the mini doll dude's chamber again, and I walk to the right, and boom, another teleporter. This has gotten me to this chamber, which I've not yet been to. Let's uh, step down and throw a weight on that. That just lets me go back, I think, and I don't want to do that. Yeah, I haven't been up here before. scanner back. Extinguish the hole before the one may appear. This will lead you further down the path of illusion. Extinguish the hole before the one may appear. That's going to take me right back to where I started if I go there. Oh, that's the corrupted tree of life there. Extinguish the hole. What does that mean? Tree of Eden. the hole before the one may appear. Well, not much to do there, I guess. And now I'm just back to the very beginning. Let me see if there's any other paths I could have took. Okay, I'm back here again. Extinguish the hole that the one may appear. Let's see. Similar to the colossal Olmec head at Leventa Ruins in Mexico. Yeah, I'm just scanning the background there. Let's talk to this guy. Can I talk to that guy? I can't talk to that guy. Oh, I can put a pedestal on him, though. Because that makes sense. Or I put a weight. Why do I keep seeing pedestal when I mean weight? I just said a weight on the skeleton. That, that, that means... No. That mean, no. That, no, that makes no sense. <sighs> anyway. There's a teleport. And that brings me here. Okay, so now I know... Okay, extinguish the whole... Does that... I think the clue on the tablet's what I was supposed to do here. So does this mean... Am I supposed to put a weight on every single one of them except for the glowing one and then the glowing one? Let's see. That comes back. It slowly goes down. And that comes back. Oh, what to do, what to do. Start this one first. Oh, I think I may have to do it just in the short time it takes for that one to get totally depressed. Yeah, and that solved something else. Alright. Oh, let's scan the tree again, just in case. Yeah, same thing. <sighs> okay. Yeah, same thing there. So, what's different? What did I do? Nothing much that I can see. I'll come back when I find something. Okay, I've come back here, uh, so you can see on the map there, and um, this new ladder has appeared that wasn't here before. Oh, 
I hope I'm, I hope I'm nearly done. Dear God. Huh. Oh, I probably need to push this down so I can stand on it to climb up the ladder. But, let's see, can I just walk through the wall? No, but I can attack it. I can do that. Okay, good. That'll let me get to the other side of this block. Push it there. Climb up. And what do you got to say for yourself? To the living. It is not too late. Give up and turn back. The illusions will only continue. God damn it! Why can't I be finished? Ugh. In fact, I'm tempted to save. I haven't saved in a really, really long time, actually. And I really don't want to, like, meet a mid-boss and lose all this progress. So I'll do that, because I think this will be easy to get back to. I'll come back. Alright, saved, healed. Let's, uh, see what further madness this place has in store for me. Going up, and up, and away. Hmm, a couple of paths I can take. Let's go over here first. Uh, nothing much there. Nothing much there. Wait, wait. Don't give up too easy. Hit things, scan things, try to set weights on things. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Let's go this way now. Hit things, scan things, try to put weights on things. Well, oh, oh, there we go. What does this say? Not something I can't read. Skip the joy. Also, there's the grail point. May not be able to reach it, but we'll see. Nope. Check over here real quick. There's a pot I can destroy. Oh, look! There's something that looks like a fairy crest on that wall there. I wonder if I can get to that. I just did just kind of j jump down here without going to the right first, didn't I? Let's see if this is somebody I can maybe help. No, I can't reach over there. Alright. Uh... Push this block aside, can't I? Oop, what do you want to bet? I just permanently screwed up some puzzle by doing that. Nothing up there. <coughs> Ooh, a fairy in Confusion Gate. What do you want to bet? That's a trap. Bones Moving Helper. What's this? Lonely House Moving. Let's move. I don't have money for it. Let's get some bombs, though. Yeah, I may need to come back here later. It won't be too hard to come back here now that I've got most of the path tromped out. Oh, this is actually a fairy. It's a healing fairy. So that's it. I'm going to be healed for joy. Wait, I can just hang through the spikes and not really care about it. So far, this part of Confusion Gate's being shockingly straightforward. Alright, what do you want to bet? I can't hit these things. I commend thee for reaching this place, wise one. Now free thyself of doubt and illusion. Uh, yep, that's not gonna work. <laughs> Free thyself of doubt and illusion. What? Push things around. Yep, I can do that. Push that together. Can I push that apart? Okay. Drop a pedestal or drop a weight. What does that do? I really didn't see anything. Let's go back. Fairy, you're being tremendously helpful. If only you were full-sized, I would marry you. Yeah, I didn't see anything change in this screen. Let's keep going. Ah, uh, this opened up, though. And let's read it. Behold the gate of illusion. The path shall open for the wise. No, no, sorry, that's bullshit. There is no wisdom that could have caused this. This was a lot of... This is some help from a friend and a lot of brute force experimentation. Be a little man, only the small shall proceed. Oh, it's time for the doll, isn't it? Okay. Or maybe it just disappears because I have the doll and I did that. Oh, whatever. Let's go down here. A lot of money, good. Money's always nice. And ghosts are going down. To this! Oh, that's... that's... ooh. Ooh. The eating the souls of the dead, it looks like. Those who do not listen do not make light of the words of others. To come so far, blinded by pride at thine own powers, thou art a true fool. A fool deserves not but death. 
He's getting healed when blood touches him, it looks like. Huh. What can I do? I... I really don't see myself hurting him while he's getting healed that fast. But sure he can spam the guy. Yeah, that's that's not happening. He's getting healed way too fast for me to do anything. Come on, not my own powers. I can't even hurt him either. This is probably gonna die, but let's just try to tank him once. If I fail, I can always come back. I may come back with enough money to get that program, because I'd really rather not come back in different confusion gate more than necessary. Yeah, this isn't working. This is not working. I've gotta destroy that blood mechanism or do something. I forgot, I saved right in Confusion Gate, so let's explore around a little bit elsewhere. Haven't been up here yet. Unlock the key t to the corridor that runs endlessly. Uh, yeah, I've already been to the Endless Corridor. This must have to be an alternate entrance to it. Let's see where this takes me. It's probably going to be a one-way thing, but I can warp back to Confusion Gate now, so... Whoa, this is open, huh? Step on that. Oh, yes, I can finally get that chest now. Let's see what's in there. <laughs> finally taking care of this puzzle. It's been daunting me for, what, 12 hours? Hey, Mr. Skeleton, how do you feel now? Yeah, because you didn't go the hard way around. This is... Yogo Map Street. It's a program. I really don't need, um, there's one of these things I don't need anymore, let's see what it was, um, uh, was it Capstar did you see? What was it? There was something I think that was, like, increasing my, um, treasure drops that I really don't need anymore. I think it was actually this, Capstar did EXE, so we'll drop that, and then go to Yagostar.exe. Okay, an advanced version of the Yago map software featuring greater details on the map. Ooh, neat! Look at that! I have details now. Awesome. Um, okay, then let's hop back to Confusion Gate. Save again. And take let's see what this one has to say. Quite a lot, actually. Alright, anyway. Um, oh, oh, I can probably drop down differently from here now. This will probably kill me, actually. What do you want to bet? Yep, it's going to kill me. And now mine will be the blood that drops in and heals the dude. Yeah, this is not the way I was supposed to come. That's where the ghosts are going. That's They're getting chopped to pieces and healing the guy. I gotta stop that from happening somehow. <laughs> Should have expected that. Okay. I go around top. Yes, I haven't gone up to the, there to the right. Also, I've just gone straight up. Let's see what's up here. Uh, going back to the very beginning. Of course, because hard things are wonderful. This time, let's just go up and to the right and see where that takes us. Yes, I can use my weapon on ladders. How about that? Hmm. Careful. Oh, that was one masterful jump. I am proud of that. Hello. Lighting your own candle vigil, huh? What am I supposed to do here, exactly? Let's fall it down, see if this takes me to the same place as before. Yep, it does. Okay, I'll go somewhere else. Um, I'll come back when I find a different... I just found it looks like that fairy, fairy block is destructible with ordinary weaponry. I thought I might have to get a key fairy to do it, but... That's... <laughs> getting the weaponry necessary in place to hit it, though, is a different story. Can I just attack it from directly across? No, it's too far down. Alright, let's just shuriken the damn thing to death. Oh, you can't. You have to whip it. Probably axe it would work, too. I have to do it quickly. Yes, I broke it. Awesome. Okay. And that gets a pedestal I can set a weight on. Hopefully it stays broken. Yeah, it stays broken. Good deal. I'll come back up. Platform my platform. And what says you? Again, no visual indicator as to what it was that changed. Was it this? No. It's not disappearing. Alright, I'll be back. Um, yeah, there was a ladder that I outright ignored last time. Take a look here. This ladder. Yeah, and this comes up here. 
which, um, I don't know if that gets me anywhere. Oh, teleporter. What fun. Oh, more of these things. Yeah, okay. Um. Oh! Okay, breaking a seal. I don't know what that just did. Dropping a weight. Okay, cool. I'm glad I had this fairy not facing that direction so I don't get shocked to death. Let's go back up here and see if I can, like, make it up to that other pedestal. Let's see. Teleport there. Don't fall down. Gonna walk back into the same teleporter? Do something? I don't know. Also, could I have interacted? That torch went out. See that? No, kind of up in the upper right. There was that would have that was a torch before. It went out. What caused that? Oh, I can go down. Forgot about that. All right. He who reads this stone tableau, are thou a wise man or a fool? We must hope that thou possesses the wisdom of a wise man. So much questioning of my wisdom, Jesus. If I've gotten that far, I'm, I'm probably not a complete, utter daft idiot. And yet another entrance to the Tower of Ruin. Okay. I'm probably... Well, here. Fuck it. You know what? We're here. May as well make some progress. I want to finish Confusion Gate, but let's just move on. Okay. Don't let the fairy continually shoot things. Huh. Ooh, opened a chest. Let's see what that got me. Yeah, you haven't been much help, fairy girl. Go away. I like your sisters better. This is just the map to the Tower of Ruin. So really, the whole thing is just for a map. That's kind of sad. Well, let's take a look at the updated map software anyway. Yeah, good enough for now. Anyway, let's go back to Confusion Gate. I think we may be nearly done. I'm hoping that the switches I've thrown will have deactivated the machine that's healing... Whatever his name probably is. It's probably one of those, like, Lovecraftian names that has all continent consonants. Like... I'm sorry, that had some vowels in it. I'm being raucously inconsistent. Okay, so should I be going back downstairs again because the torch went out? Is that supposed to be my clue that the the dude down there is now assaultable? Let's go take a look, I guess. I, I've kind of covered up the pit. I covered up the pit? That's it. The ghosts can't fall down anymore. Why did it take me so long to notice that? <laughs> All right. Let's see if I can take this asshole out now. Actually, let's save first. I've got nearly full health, so we're as good as we're gonna get on that. All right, let's go do this. Do this like Brutus. Be there like freeware. Yeah, the machine is no longer dripping upon him. Okay, so um, you know what? Fuck it. Get the gun out. This guy's an underworld monstrosity. I really don't feel the like I'm in the mood to fuck around with this dude. Wasting bullets, this is not cool. How do I not do that? How do I keep him from guarding himself? Oh, I'm supposed to fake him out, huh? Well, I'm out of bullets now, so it doesn't matter. Shudikins. I could probably axe him to death, but I'm afraid I couldn't really tank it. He's a lot bigger than me, after all. Yeah, okay, so I'm supposed to fake him out is what I'm supposed to do. You know what? Fuck it. Get in there. Do this with the axe. This thing does shit tons of damage, so... Besides, I just saved. It's not a big deal if I... Yeah, yeah, got him. Oh, 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 duh. The ghosts. Are they grateful to me? The key of eternity. <laughs> Close. But you can't kill me that easily, game. I'm too persistent for that. Let's see what this thing even does, anyway. Key of Eternity. Key that can unlock the seals in the endless corridor. Press the item button to insert the key. Awesome. So I can actually take that area on now. Let's move on, anyway. Is, is that it? Have I completed Confusion Gate? I'm gonna find out. I'll be right back. Yeah, I've determined that's, uh, that's all I'm gonna do for now. 
I've com completed Confusion Gate as it is for the moment. I guess next I'll be taking on the, the Endless Corridor. Look fun to that. Look fun to that. What does that mean? Look forward to that because we'll have fun. Good job combining your concepts into linguistic mishmash, UB. 